Welcome back to Elden Ring, everyone. I really feel like I need to get away from One Shot City up here. Uh, and I was thinking of where I could explore that I haven't checked out yet. Uh, I haven't really looked at this castle right here. This is like sort of the far edge of Lyrnia of the Lakes. And I, I don't even know why I didn't come here. King's Realm Ruins. Oh, but this is something first. Because, you know, I found this place and I was like, oh, cool. I'm gonna ignore it, uh, and I don't know why I, did. I ignored it. And there's like clearly stuff here, and maybe significant stuff. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Depending on how much this takes, and this I think is an optional area, so I don't think we're gonna be spending too much overall time here. Like if we get like wrapped up here, I think I'm gonna go to Kaelid. Uh, check out the other part of Kaelid because mm, I don't know man. I feel like that's another place where we can make progress There's supposed to be like I think two more The shard bearer bosses, right? I think so So I'm hoping what that equates to is that we have multiple paths to explore. God, I hate that you can't open your map when there's like an enemy. Oh yeah, that's like pretty obvious. All right. Might have taken me a while to figure it out, but listen, we've we've made it, right? Is there a giant reading a book? Let me guess, spellcaster, blacksmith. Look at you. We don't receive many visitors. Your voice is not as cool as the giant blacksmith. What brings you here? Oh, pardon me. It's hardly my place to. But <laughs> this is pretty cool. I am not gonna lie, E. G. Yeah, that's a blacksmith. Cool. An old codger who refuses to retire his rusty hammer. The skybox is really cool here, and just mentioned that. Still quietly plying my trade on this spot. Perhaps you'd like a display. These bones are old, but still able. Let's do it. Oh, watch out there. When I'm absorbed in my smithing. <laughs> that's really cool. Yeah, look at my character looking up. This this dude is chill. What is he? Oh, he has somber smithing stones. Cool. Well, you don't really have shit. I thought I could upgrade something, but I can't. Damn. Yeah, I'm like sort of. What the hell is that? Oh! Where... The actual shit is that coming from? That one is being real tricky here. It's always them int builds. Causing trouble. Let's see if there's anything here. In the side path. Oh, one of these places. Nice. Well, we can loot this. Always very convenient to get some uh, golden runes. The rats are mad annoying too. But I can just tank all this damage. All of these places really are like the embodiment of that question of 
when does archaeology turn into grave robbing or when does grave robbing turn into archaeology i'm pretty sure that's still grave robbing because i straight up stole all that shit from their graves oh well it's all for the tarnished i have no clue what the hell is causing this some trickster can i read the sword in peace Apparently I cannot. It's all good. Guessing once I'm in here it ain't gonna be a problem. But this does seem like something significant. Carry a manor. Hmm. And this place is an interesting atmosphere. Oh shit! What? What the fuck? <laughs> Am I stoned? What the actual hell is that? That's like the... It's like an extreme version of that odd little one cute Jesus can I catch a break here this is like that extreme version of that weird enemy from Dark Souls 3 are they definitely like how wouldn't they have grab attack from Dark Souls 3 you know in the Yorm area you know what I'm talking about this is so <laughs> fucked up but kind of awesome Listen, again, you can't really fault this game for enemy creativity. And it looks like they're, like, dropping smithing stones left and right. Somber smithing stones, which is actually super useful. See, now this, like, this is what I'm talking about. Like, compared to the capital. Like, this feels appropriate for my level like this area you know these are the enemies where i feel like yeah like this is where i'm meant to be that's kind of creepy I'm not gonna lie like you'd shit your pants if you saw this thing coming towards you right i would For sure. I got their Sammy Davis Jr. like rings on their fingers. I guess they're all fingers, so you know. I wonder what the lore is on these guys. Sure, wanna find out, Vati. When are you gonna start with them Elden lore videos? This is straight up giving me the middle finger. Like, there's no other way to say it. It's straight up giving me the finger through a magic attack. I just did, <laughs> did that. I know, I know, people have said that you can turn off the motion... Uh, ...controls for the gestures, which really is something I should do. But I'm probably not gonna. Oh! Tricky. I just realized that... No, no, we had... Oh, yeah, we had a... Checkpoint at the start. Okay, this is... With no poise, this is a little bit... Yeah, okay. There, there was a lot of you there. Gotta be careful. I just realized I gotta be careful not to lose my... Souls, because I have like 20k there. Enough for a level, for sure. It's weird that the little ones make such a huge shockwave, too. 
Oh, come. I'm sorry, that, that was... That was a bit BS. How do I have a solution to you guys? If the camera would cooperate and the controls would as well. Knew it. I fucking knew it. That these guys would get destroyed by Glintstone Arc. Fucking... <sighs> it's gonna explode. Oh, okay. That was not what I was expecting. Jesus, you really can't escape them. Ah, oh, mother... This is... Okay. There's so many of them. Man, I wish you could use Torrent in here. These guys would get absolutely demolished if you could. It's like, you need to get the little ones first. Because that those are the ones that like overwhelm you. They're like the dogs, you know, or like the rats. You see? Once you do that, you can do something like... I said you can do something like... You can't. Like, you know what I wanted. And don't tell me that wouldn't have been smart. Killed a lot of them now. There's probably a sh still a shit ton around. Is this just the main path? Yeah, it is. Cool. I mean, you might as well take the main path. thing is, I have, like, no clue where this could all possibly lead. Aside from having one of these things as a boss. Luckily, that still works. As in, like, I did check that mashing does actually allow you to escape graphs quicker. I think in this game it's mashing any button. You don't even have to do the triggers. But I think it used to be the triggers. The older games. Interesting. I feel like this could very well lead to a boss, like a giant, giant version of these things. You know, like, uh, I don't know. That would be kind of boring, but I'd fuck with it, honestly. Uh, shit. Okay, I'm barely, I'm like, barely missing a couple of hundred souls. Let's fix that. I'm going with Vigor, learning from, like, previous uh, events. I feel like Vigor is the way to go here. We're, like, above the bong smoke now. 
See, this is... This is more like it. I like it when I can actually... You know, kill the enemies. Oh yeah? Brass shield, cool. I misread that as something completely different and I didn't want to even want to say it. That's why it took I had like a little double take there. Naisu, I do like them rune arcs. We discussed the Oh shit. Why did I have a feeling that that was gonna happen? Cool, I have 600 souls there. I don't even give a shit. Whoa, what the hell was that? Anyways, speaking of rune arcs, I just popped one. Because I was like, you know what? They are meant to be used. So, screw it, I'm using it. Uh, so yeah, I now have way more HP, which is nice. The fact that this boosts your HP is very helpful. Maybe this is what you need against that tree sentinel. There's a lot of you there. But I feel like I would just get demolished either way. Uh, but it's something I'm definitely... If I'm... You know, I've talked about this, that I'm trying not to look things up for this game. Uh, but if there's one thing I'm going to be looking up ever, is this, like, are you meant to just, like, level Vigor to a ridiculous amount in this game? Is that just how it is? Because if it is, I'm cool with that. It's just, again, you know, it's the coming from previous Souls games. You basically never had to do that. But we're not there yet because I'm just exploring here. So... Yeah, as long as there are alternative options, I'm never gonna say that, you know, this area is bullshit and things deal too much damage because it's an open world game. Just the very nature of it means that it's very possible that I accidentally stumbled upon some, like, very high level area and it's just, you know, somewhere I'm not meant to be. Yeah, like with Lanedale, the royal capital as well, like, who the fuck knows how many enemies I'm meant to take out before. I'm just going towards there because there is a thing that will allow me more flasks. You know what? I respect that wolf. I'm gonna leave it alone. This one I had to kill because hopefully there weren't like a bonded pair or something. But this place, yeah, this, this area is super cool. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I feel like we're meant to take this ladder. Yeah, no idea what this possibly could lead to. But hey. That's sort of the nature of this game. And this weapon is pretty cool as well. So you can... That's what I was hoping. See, now the question is, could you jump and critical him? I'm not sure. Yeah, just ignore any noise you hear, giant. Oh, hey there. I know you guys. Man, did I struggle against you. Only thing is, the one I fought had the triple shot. Of course, there's more of them. 
Co. Haven't used that attack in quite a while. I don't know why. It's just probably because I'm not using my shield too much. You know, maybe I should. See now. Why do you have to tempt me with stuff like this game? We're sticking to the main. See, the, the constant dilemma is. Okay. Royal Knight Loretta. Hello there. Man, am I tired of horse bosses. She's basically a tree sentinel, except she does magic. But she's weak. Yeah. Wolfos, come on. Yeah, she's super weak. See, this is what I'm. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Why I'm not gonna say I'm like under leveled or the game is being bullshit. Because there's always alternative options. That's like, you know, the best thing about open world games. Yeah, that was mad easy. Loretta's great bow. Oh, nice. Is that a that that's a spell, right? Cool. Yeah, that didn't give jack shit in terms of souls, but wasn't really expecting anything. Did, however, give a checkpoint, which is very convenient because then I can check out that ledge. See, now this is some... Now this is Souls platforming. Wish it was this easy in Bloodborne. I swear to you, if this doesn't lead anywhere, I'm gonna be so angry. Or does it lead to... Uh, they're just hostile pots. Why are you guys always hostile? Except that one dude. You know which one I'm talking about. Alexander, I think. Who we haven't seen since, which is uh, something I'm a little bit sad about. I really thought he was gonna be the Solaire of this game. And he's not. See, if I designed the Elden Ring, he sure as hell would be the Solaire equivalent. Is that it? Nope. There's like a weird sort of descending path here. He's either going to lead to a really big secret or jack shit uh it's really either or okay that is not an attack i was expecting i'm gonna be totally honest here <laughs> that's a way to do it yeah thank you camera for cooperating with me Oh god, I have stupid runes on, right? Or art rune on, so... I really don't want to die. Shit. 
shit. Sorry, Pots. I think you're cool, but hey. Wonder if you can get them as a summon. So you can just continue to descend weirdly. Yeah, and then land on top here, giving you Ash of War Carrion Grander. I'm guessing all these are like int things, but that's cool. I'm I'm down. I fuck with that. Not that I'm gonna use it, but still. All right. What was she protecting? Sorry about your chair. Three sisters. Okay. I'm guessing there are three towers here, right? It's like the whole thing. Rena's rise. Blocked shot for now. Isn't Rena? No, that was Renala. Okay. Chilling Mist. That sounds frostbite ish. Which Frostbite is in this game. Whoa. Is that a dra. That is straight up a dragon. Glinstron Dragon Adula. Oh, he's easy. I wasn't expecting another boss, but... If you're gonna give it, yeah, why not? He seems like... Way easier, as in I'm like way stronger than... With the previous version. Oh, did he just like fucking... B what? Hey, that's not fair. You can't just... I'm about to harvest you for runes. You can't just like peace out of there. Sorry, Wolfos. Ronnie's Rise. Man, I wish all the wolves weren't hostile. Cool. I'm not sure about the crystal decoration, but... It's all good. I have no idea what the hell this could possibly even lead to. I always forget to check if there is a... No, there isn't. You know, talk to Melania or Melina prompt. Nice view, though. I'd take an apartment with a view like that. A tiny house. Well, this is a little bit ominous, I'm not gonna lie. And oh, that's the third one. Oh, nice. Yeah, cool view. It's just You have Star Wars balconies. And what the hell is over there, that way? There's like straight up... Huh. Oh, again we cross paths. Oh yeah, I remember her. My name was Rena. Rena, yeah. It pleased me to see Torrent hale and hearty, but tarnished. What business hast thou here? I have no memory of ink and be an invitation. You didn't. No particular reason. Hmm. 
This is a quest. Mm. Why does this feel like the bad ending, right? <laughs> this this very much feels like this is leading towards the bad ending. Ah, uh, uh, fuck it. A choice well made. Thou art I can always just like not do this. Not many would have accepted the offer, but I require as much of those under my command. I anticipate good work from me. Yeah, if you need much from me, I ain't gonna do Good. jack shit. Then I ask we proceed with haste. There is in my service a half woven warrior. Oh, we've met him. He's cool. I would have thee join him in searching for the hidden treasure of Nokron, the eternal city. I have called for Blythe to greet thee below. Take from him the particulars. Cool. Oh, okay. We met EG as well. Peculiarities. Feel secure in gaining from them. What advantage thou canst. I am sure the others will be doing just the same. Cool. Peace out. Alright. So what's up? We gotta meet the wolf and get like the quest quest deeds from him. Yeah, this is definitely. This is definitely major. You can always tell. With Souls games, you can always tell what's like, you know, a side path and what's like a proper, like, you know, big detour. You have gross feet. Let us give all that we can of ourselves together for Lady Ronnie. Hmm. Feels a bit cultish. I am not gonna lie. My my cult radar is going off. Long time friend. Blythe. Have you forgotten? It's kinda hard to forget. Oh, like we've been there, right? To the yeah. So we gotta go back there and join him. <laughs> nice hat. I see. You must be Rani's new hireling. Yes, yes, I've heard all about you. You sound like the dickhead, like he has that voice, that nasally voice. Yeah, he's definitely the dickhead. But since we have the misfortune of serving the same lady, I ask that you kindly try not to... God, there's always one, isn't there? Always one. I reside in... Come and pay me, should you wish to be. If it were up to me, I wouldn't. But who am I to say? God, I want to go kill this guy right now. He's definitely down there. But I feel like that would screw up this quest line. Because, what the hell? What? There's like... Did I not talk to someone? Oh shit. Oh, we gotta go... I bet you we gotta go back up. Because we talked to everyone, right? This better be it. Still, I have high hopes. 
hopes for thee. I look forward to the good news when I arise. Okay. I shall soon end and it will be some I have high look for. Okay, can I go now? That would be real good. Oh yeah, we're good, we're good. See, I should have been clued in because there were no enemies when we walked out here. Although, to be fair, I did kill them. Okay, let's visit Mr. Sorcerer. He's gotta be here. Like, this would be somewhere where he would reside. Acting all snarky. What up? Well, well, you took me at my word. Cool mass, though. Did you not realize I was merely being polite? Oh. Provincials never cease to amaze. God, it's tempting to press this button right here. It's an R2. Luvis's potion, interesting. Uh, I don't trust this guy. Like, I trust him even less than all the others. Oh, you're pushing it, buddy. You are pushing it. Couple of snarky remarks. And you're getting r 2 for sure. Mint memory stone. I have like a shit ton of uh, spell slots and nothing to put there. Yeah, I think with this we have certainly done something. Uh, yeah, this feels significant. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this episode now. Uh, because I think, like, we're appropriately, like, we're just in a good place. This is, for sure, the start of something. So, yeah, that's about it. What I'm gonna do is I'll wrap up this episode of Elden Ring here. If you did enjoy, make sure to give this video a like, comment, subscribe. Can't be yawning. That's bad. I cut, like, half of that out. It's still like five minutes. Uh, it is pretty late, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode of Elden Ring. And I hope to catch you next time. Did I say if you did enjoy, like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications? Whatever. I'm going to say it again. Peace out and goodbye.